Welcome to the Blockchain Report. We discuss all things blockchain technology, digital assets, DeFi, NFTs, and much more. Today's video, we're diving into the Clusters project that was just launched by Layer Zero. This is a pretty interesting little project <clears throat> as this is taking all of your addresses from all over different blockchains and creating one central location for everything to live. <clears throat> so no more remembering 20 different wallets and all that sorts of stuff that can make things more <clears throat> cumbersome in this space. So Cluster works with all of your addresses, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Solana, Layer 2s, and then more coming soon. <clears throat> and so we will kind of dive in and see what um, clusters we can we can create. So yeah, this is a really cool interesting little project that just launched <clears throat> and is live now so before we actually get started thank you so much for joining please like subscribe comment share this out to anyone you think will be interested in blockchain technology all the cool stuff we get to learn and the fun rewards we earn along the way and if you need help with anything that we cover on this channel quests campaigns airdrops what have you jump in the discord link is in the description of the video below and get in there connect with me and other members of the community and yeah let's grow in the space together so with that let's dive into clusters okay So meet Star NYE, who uses lots of wallets across lots of blockchains. It's confusing to remember which ones are related. <clears throat> There's too much fragmentation. So you have your EVM um, wallet addresses, and then your Solana. I don't know what the difference is with this one, but introducing clusters the first cross-chain name service multiple blockchains multiple wallets one name we're bringing the blockchain world back together 3312 names and counting so your universal name <clears throat> buy a name on any chain and it automatically appears on the others no more squatting our uh, demand-based pricing al algorithm makes it expensive to steal other people's names and it's always cheap to register pretty cool so we'll go ahead and, and register well, let's connect our wallet first we're gonna we're gonna go with the rad okay now I'm going to register on Arbitrum 1. <clears throat> the blockchain report. Ooh. So it looks like You see my balance? No. Um, so I don't have enough Ethereum <clears throat> on here. Let's see if I have any on base. I, I don't think I've I think I've like exhausted my Ethereum. <laughs> um, and what else? What other chains were there? B and B. I think that's the most I have on BNB. I'm going to have to come in here and mint. Um... Oh, no, I got. OK, so we'll mint this on BNB that way. Actually, you know what? I'm going to. BCR one four two. So 
So we will claim and see if uh, if this works. Did it deposit? Huh. Should go to the next one, right? Oh. Oh. So you have to have a bridge fee. Okay, so I do need more BNB. Looks like I'm a looking like a fool with my pants on the ground. So I will need to come in here and bridge some funds. So give me one minute. And this is the fun of not having enough funds on. Okay, I'll just switch from. Uh... Doo -doo. I'm going to go with some Manta. and some funds over <clears throat> to BNB because I would like to I'd like to do this now and show you Once this gets bridged, we will be able to have a better um, idea of what this looks like. Because I want you to see, <clears throat> when covering this, I want to actually look and see what all is involved. <clears throat> So you can check your clusters on layer zero now. Pretty cool. And I don't think that layer zero has done their snapshot yet, so this would be good to do as far as getting a uh, qualifying for an airdrop. Because <clears throat> nobody knows what the real metrics will be. So we'll wait for this to complete. It says three minutes, but <clears throat> we've been here before and gotten <clears throat> gotten hosed on waiting for things to arrive. Let's see what else they have to offer. So they got directories. <clears throat> it looks like they had some website issues today. Hmm. Let's see here. Uh, 
up and here we go <clears throat> looks like um we got our bnb so there we go we'll log out of here and now that i have enough funds now remember this is a one-time mint fee so you yeah it's gonna be 40 50 bucks just because you have to bridge funds to clusters so this will be um kind of pricey to start but remember this is for all of your wallets that you have linked to this cluster so this is perfect for me and how i can have all the accounts for my blockchain report um in this one cluster and have my personal stuff in another cluster this is cool because i i really have been wanting something like this <clears throat> now remember doing this on the ethereum network will be expensive you're gonna probably double that <clears throat> with uh transaction fees so arbitrum one avalanche base or bnb is the best way to go Okay. So we are So I wonder if if clusters is like a Okay. So I wonder if this is like a a layer 1 that has that has to um You have to pay the fees on that layer it's not like its own it's its own thing it's weird <clears throat> it's really weird but if you want to skip through this this will be uh <clears throat> it'll be a few minutes
Okay, it looks like this is taking a while. <clears throat> I don't know if this is just, um... Yeah, this is taking way too long. I was hoping it wouldn't take this long, but, um... Oh, it looks like it did it for me, so... I don't know why... Maybe it's just having some funky issues with uh with the website right now. But I was wanting to kind of look at this a bit more. So okay. Directories. Okay, so it doesn't look like you can really do much right now. <clears throat> but I guess... Um, I guess we're still waiting. But I might uh, just cut this and continue it in a separate video once it's complete. So we will wait for this to finish and we'll come back to this. <clears throat> 